again, my little yarn of ores and spider ads. Fiber Spider back again with the continuation, part three, of the pineapple shawl tutorial. And we are on row 16. Now, this is actually part of the, the repeat that we're going to be doing because, as I said, I want to be thorough. So, some of this may seem, you know, overtly familiar. Otherwise, I would say, Enjoy the ride. All right, so start by chaining up three and into that chain one space, cluster, two doubles, chain one, two doubles, as per usual, two doubles, chain one, two doubles. Okay, now, like we did down here, because we had this chain three space, right? Well, we have to create the new arch for the new pineapple. So, after doing our cluster, chain two into the chain three space, double, chain three, and double into that same space. And that creates the new arch, which will give us room for our 10 double crochets on the next row. And of course I hit a knot straight off the bat and I didn't even pull out that much yarn. My goodness. Do I just love it? <laughs> All right, sorry about that. Okay, so from here, chain two and then into the chain one space, another cluster, two doubles, chain one, two doubles, there we go, and then working on our pineapple in the usual fashion, which is chain three, single in the loop, chain three, single in the next loop, and so forth across the top of the pineapple, chain three, and single, chain three, and single, chain three, and single, chain three, and we've run out of, <laughs> we've run out of loops. So into this next cluster, do a cluster. Be sure to have your single crochet and your chain three. So into that chain one space, two doubles, chain one, and two doubles. Okay, now the reason why I decided to do this repeat is because the middle sections may seem a little bit weird because we have where this pineapple from previously ended and we're going to start a new one right above it. So in this chain three space, we are going to be doing the exact same thing that we did over here. So after doing your cluster, chain two into the chain three space, double crochet, chain three, and double crochet. Chain two, and then into the next chain space, another cluster two doubles, chain one, two doubles. Okay, and we've reached another pineapple. So chain three, single in the loop, chain three, single in the next loop, chain three, single in the next, chain three, single in the next, chain three, single in the next. Okie dokie. So we have reached, almost just about reached the, the top and the center spine here. So chain three, now into this first chain one space, cluster, two 
two doubles, chain one, two doubles, almost had it. Okay, chain three. Okay, into this chain three space, do the exact same thing that we did over here and at the beginning. So we've got our cluster and did I chain three? I think I chain three, it's chain two, excuse me. So after the cluster, chain two into the chain three space, double chain three double. There we go. Chain two into the center spine, do a cluster, two doubles, chain one, two doubles. chain two into the chain three space, double, chain three, double, chain two, and cluster into that chain one space of the cluster. So that's two doubles, chain one, two doubles. Okay, so we have the the top finished, and now we're going to have to finish the second half of our shawl. All right, be right back. Okay, so for the second half of row 16, we just did the top, so chain three, because we're going to be working on the top of the pineapple. One, two, three, single into that loop, chain three, single into the next loop, chain three, single into the next, and so forth. And I've run out of loops already. Okay, so chain three. And into the cluster, two doubles, chain one, two doubles. So I've got my two doubles, chain one, two doubles. Okay into that chain three space, well, chain two, double, chain three, double, into that same space, chain two, and then cluster into the next cluster, two doubles, chain one, two doubles. Okay, one more of these pineapples to go. Chain three, double, sorry, single into the loop. I get tongue tied, I'm a, I'm a human spider. Okay, so chain three, single, chain three, single into the next, chain three, single into the next, chain three, single into the next, chain three, and single into that last space. Okay, so from here, chain three, and cluster into that chain one space of the cluster, two doubles, chain one, two doubles,
chain two and working into the last chain three space, double, chain three, double, chain two, and cluster into the last cluster. Two doubles, chain one, two, doubles. There you go. And that is the end of row 16 for the repeat. Row 17. Chain up three. Turn the work. Cluster in the cluster. Two doubles, chain one, two doubles. chain two, and then 10 double crochets into this chain three space. So chain two, and then 10 doubles. One, two, three, thank you, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. But yet yeah, I am going to double count. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Perfect. Okay. It's much better to double count than to have to undo an entire row of work. Oy. All right, chain two, cluster in the chain one space of the previous cluster. So two doubles, chain one, two doubles. Okay, working in the top of this pineapple, chain three, single crochet into that first loop, chain three, single into the next loop, chain three, single into the next, chain three, and single into that last loop. Okay. Chain three, cluster into the cluster, two doubles, chain one, two doubles, okay, we need 10 more double crochets here, so chain two, 10 doubles, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten, two, four, six, eight, ten, yep, okay, chain two, cluster in the cluster, two doubles, chain one, two doubles, chain three, because we're going to be going into the top of this pineapple here. Single in the loop. Chain three. Single in the next loop. Chain three. Single in the next loop. Chain three. 
Single in the next loop. We're out of loops. Okie dokie. So, reaching the top here. Okie doke. Chain three. Cluster in the cluster. Two doubles. Chain one, two doubles. Okay, so 10 double crochets needed here. So chain two, 10 double crochets in the ch chain three space, excuse me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Okay, good. Chain two, cluster in that center spine cluster. Two doubles, chain one, two doubles. Okay, and now we get to go down the opposite side. <laughs> okay. Okay, so we just did the center spine, so going down the opposite side now. Chain two, 10 doubles in the chain three space. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten, yes? Yep, good. Okay. Chain two. Cluster into that next cluster. Okay, working across the top of this pineapple here. Chain three. Single. Chain three and single, chain three, and single, chain three, single, chain three. No more, no more loops. So it sneaks up on you, you know? Okay, so I did my chain three, cluster in the cluster, Two doubles, chain one, two doubles, and we have another little chain three space there. So, chain two, ten doubles, one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Yep, okay. Chain two. 
cluster in the cluster. Two doubles, chain one, two doubles. Chain three, single in that loop, chain three, single in the next loop, chain three, single in the next loop, chain three, single in the next loop, and we're out of loops. So pull out a little bit more yarn. Chain three. Cluster in the cluster. So that's two doubles, chain one, two doubles. Okay, we've got another grouping of 10 we need to do. So chain two, 10 doubles in that chain three space. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yep, okay. Chain two. And cluster in the last cluster. With two doubles. If I can stop fudging my stitches. Don't, we don't want no fudged stitches. So two doubles, chain one, two doubles. Here we go. Ta-da! Okay, so that is the end of row 17 for the repeat. And we are getting there. Yes, we are. Alrighty. Okay, row 18. Chain up three, cluster in the cluster, two doubles, chain one, two doubles. Okay, and now we need to have our fan of ten doubles branch out a little bit, needs some space, so chain two and double in the double, chain one, double in the double, chain one, double in the double, and so forth for all 10. And I didn't do a chain one, did I? It happens. There we go. That's better. Okay, one more. Okay, chain two. Cluster in the cluster. Chain three. Work across the top of our previous pineapple. Single in the loop. Chain three. Single in the loop. Chain three, single in the loop, and we're out of loops. So chain three, cluster in the cluster, OK, 
Okay. Scoot your work as necessary. Pull out more yarn as necessary. Do whatever it is that is necessary. <laughs> okay, so we need to have these doubles branching out a little bit. So chain two, double in the double, chain one, double in the next, chain one, double in the next, and so forth for the rest of the ten. And one more. Okay, chain two, cluster in the cluster, chain three. Single in the next loop, chain three, single in the next, chain three, single in the next, and we're out of loops. Okay. And we are almost at the top once again. So from here, chain three. Cluster in the cluster, chain two, double in the double, chain one, double in the next, chain one, double in the next and so forth. Okay, just two more. Chain two, and in the center spine, that cluster, yep, another cluster. Two doubles, chain one, two doubles. Okay, so let's go back down the other side, shall we? Alrighty. Okay, so after doing the center spine, chain two and branch out these doubles. So double in the double, chain one, double in the next, chain one and so forth for all 10. Okay. And one more. There we are. Chain two, cluster in the cluster. Scoot the work. Chain three. 
single into that first loop there. Chain three, single in the next, chain three, and single in the next. Okay, out of loops. So chain three, cluster in the cluster. chain two, and branch out this fan of doubles. So double in the double, chain one, double in the next, chain one, double in the next, chain one, and so forth for the rest of the 10. Two more. There we go. Chain two, cluster into the cluster. And we are in, believe it or not, the home stretch for row 18 relatively speaking. So from here, chain three, single in the loop, chain three, single in the next loop, chain three, single in the next loop. Okay, chain three, cluster in the cluster, bit more yarn. Chain two. Double in the double. Chain one. Double in the next double. Chain one. Double in the next. Chain one. And so forth for the remainder of the 10 doubles. chain two, and into that last chain one space of the last cluster, do, yes, another cluster. So that is two doubles, chain one, and two doubles. And there you go. That is the end of row 18. All right, row 19, chain up three. Turn the work, cluster into the cluster, okay, now because we're going to be working in the chain one spaces, now is the time where we start with the chaining of three here. So one, two, three, single in the chain one space, because we're creating the boop loops, remember? So chain three, single in the next space, chain three, single in the next, chain three, 
single in the next space, chain three, single in the next, chain three, single in the next, chain three, and so forth. Okie dokie. So from here, chain three and cluster into the cluster. Okay, and we're almost done with the top of this pineapple. We are getting there. So chain three, single in that loop, chain three, single in the next loop, and we have no more loops. We only have one loop left over. All right, chain three, Cluster into the cluster. Okay, and now we need to create the the boop loops on this fan. So, chain three, single in the chain one space, chain three, single in the chain one space, chain three, single in the chain one space, and so forth. Okay, moving right along, chain three, cluster in the cluster. Chain three, single in the loop, chain three, single in the next loop, and we're out of loops. It happens. Okay, so chain three, cluster in the cluster. Chain three, single in the chain one space, chain three, single in the next chain one space, chain three, single in the next, chain three, single in the next, and so forth for all of these chain one spaces. Okay, just two more. Okay, chain three. And we reached the center spine once again. So cluster in the cluster. With 
two doubles, chain one, two doubles, as per usual. Okay, so now that we've reached the top, we can go down the other side. <laughs> Okay, so after doing the center spine, working down the opposite side, chain three, single on the chain one space, chain three, single on the chain one space, and so forth for the rest of this grouping. Okay, chain three, cluster in the cluster. Chain three. Single in that loop, chain three, single in the next loop, we're out of loops, chain three, cluster in the cluster. Chain three, single in the chain one space, chain three, single in the next chain one space, chain three, single in the next, and so forth. Okay, chain three, cluster in the cluster. Alrighty. Chain three, single in the loop. Chain three, single in the next loop, chain three, cluster in the cluster. And we are in the home stretch, my dears. Yep. Chain three. Single in the chain one space, chain three, single in the chain one space, and so forth for the rest of this grouping. Okay, chain three, and cluster in the cluster. Okay, 
All right. And there you go. That's the end of row 19. Alrighty, my dear. So that concludes part three of our tutorial series. Now giving you a quick overview. So as you can see, we have made quite a bit of progress indeed. Now, you may be wondering to yourself, my piece, it looks really roughly like there are too many stitches. Well, that's because we haven't completely closed up this point to this point, closing up the top of this pineapple here. Yes, I have it upside down, uh, closing up the top of this pineapple, which will cinch it together and it will make it lay more flat because right now we are in the middle of a repeat due to video recording time constraints. I can only go so far. So in the next part of this series, we will finish up the repeat in its entirety. And then after that, I will be able to show you how you can do the finishing edges. So basically right, right, right now what we're doing, it's rounds 16 through 19. Next video, it's going to be rounds 20 through 22. Okay, and that'll be the full repeat of the repeat because yes, I like to be thorough. <laughs> and uh, after that, you know, you will be able to do as many of these repeats as you want to, to achieve the size that you're going for. Now, as I mentioned before, I went with a total of six pineapples. So we have one right here, and then we have this one, which is almost done. And then we have this one, which we're beginning. So I had a total of six from top to bottom, and that worked out just fine for me as far as how large I wanted the shawl to be. So that gives you an idea how much further you have to go from here. So that being said, as always, listen guys, thank you so very much for watching. I really appreciate you hanging out with me today. And if you are liking this yourself, give a little thumbs up button down below, please. I always appreciate your appreciation and your lovely comments. Thank you. So, until I release the next part of this video, you know what to do. I want all of you to stay inspired, stay caffeinated, stay stitching, and please stay safe. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you soon in the next part. Bye for now, everybody, and have a great day.